Okay, going on to uh, question 15 now from Magnety Man. And so uh, we're going down to here. It's another similar situation where we don't have enough time to fully analyze it. And so <clears throat> we have to cut our losses here. Some things have to be drawn. Um, I don't really know what that is. I'll just have to confirm uh, whether that makes sense. Yeah, that does. That's a triple bond. Um, does that make sense as, no, it doesn't make sense as a double, uh, it makes sense as a triple. Um, NH3, some of this stuff needs to be memorized. I'm, I'm going with the ammonia and the water as assumptions that you've done so much work with this now that you can, don't have to do the full analysis to work out what that is and you can remember what the structure is because a minute and a half is not enough time to uh, work those out actually. All right, so let's try and um, limit our time here. Uh, geometry is pretty easy. Uh, so let's try and see if we can uh, cut our time down by going that direction. Um, and so that one is linear. Square planar. Um, square planar is going to have to be like, you know, like an, an X thing. So uh, we can manage to cross out, cross out one at least. Uh, that's trigger primordial. That's pr okay, so that was able to get rid of one of them for us. Um, that looks like the hardest, so I'm see if I can get rid of this. Electron domains for the carbon. Um, there's one here and there's one here, so there's two. I've already crossed that one out. Three, well there's four here, so that's another, a second thing, and there's four here as well. All right, so I've, I've, I've managed to uh, get rid of these two now. Um, so I am having to analyze all three sections, which is probably what they wanted to do anyway. Um, that's water, so there's no hybridization. Uh, so that makes life easy. Um, here you've got um, here two s's, two sigmas, uh, and you've got uh, one pi, uh, and the pi comes from the overlap of two, the two p, uh, or the p orbitals. Um, so that means I just need uh, two of these, uh, two hybridizations. So sp gives us two. So there's two sp hybridizations forming the sigma bonds. So that agrees, uh, and so it must be A. All right, I'm hoping that can be done in your head a little bit faster. That's really pushing the minute and a half. Um, so uh, it is quite difficult. You should be able to cut your losses down by having some easier questions to give yourself some more time for these ones that take a little bit more than a minute and a half, I 